Welcome to Thunder Bay Live. I'm at the uh, Garden Angels uh, headquarters. I'm here with Brian Phillips from Home Depot. Brian, your, uh, your company has decided to sponsor the Garden Angels. Yep. Why did you decide to sponsor this particular group? Uh, I have history with the Yen. We go back uh, to the high school days. Um, we as a whole, uh, Home Depot, like to give back to the community and support uh, community endeavors. And the Guardian Angels was a good fix for us because we know they give back to the community all the time. Uh, Home Depot has certain programs in place to benefit organizations in town through Grant Foundation, uh, our volunteer situation, or running free seminars for uh, anybody who's interested. So working with the Inn, it'll give his participants a chance to learn some skills at no charge. Uh, and we'll run classes as often as they need. And what is the philosophy behind the programs you choose? Is there a criteria? Uh, there's no criteria, it's just giving the life skills back to people in a tr so they can learn a trade uh, and benefit from that because in everyday life now you need to know something and if we can benefit one person or ten people uh, with painting or drywalling or plumbing then it will help them later in life. Brian, thank you very much. You're welcome, uh, thank you all. It's always nice to see a, a community a business give back to the community. We are all over giving back. Um, that's our motto being here in Thunder Bay. Uh, we may be a big box retailer, but we certainly uh, have given back thousands over the last two years, and we will continue to do so. <laughs> From when we were kids. From when we were kids. When we were kids. Is that right? And he, and he said to me this morning, there's a huge reason why we hooked up again in life. And, and a lot of, I need to say, this clubhouse is the way it is. Uh, you know, thanks to Home Depot, they, they, they donated everything for us to redo the bathroom and, and a lot, the painting and, and, and uh, you, you know, since then, and, and just kind of snowballed from there, I came to them with a crazy idea of uh, how can we help these people earn a living, and I know he does nothing but volunteer his spare time doing these after-hour things of teaching people how to work these life skills. And I said, well, why don't we partner up and do something? And it just kind of snowballed from there. And now it's a pilot project, and it's going to change a lot of people's lives. Wow, that's, that's amazing. I so up he like went that. for the, the bully in school picking on me <laughs> to not yeah. doing the right thing. One of the guys saving me from the bullies in school. <laughs> <laughs> so it's but, great. Well, it's nice to see that, like I said, uh, I'm, I'm a retailer, a yeah. box retailer, giving back to the community, helping out an organization that helps the community. Yes, I was going to talk to you too, if you don't I was going to talk to you as in terms of to be a garden angel, what does it take? Or who, what type of people are you looking for? Garden angels kind of try to find value in everybody. Unfortunately, it's like I said today in the, in, in the brief moment I had in front of the camera, um, there's always going to be somebody who acts, reacts negatively to what you're doing. No matter what you try to do, there's always somebody who's going to act, uh, is going to just make fun of you or attack you or whatever. The guardian angels, it's, it's this simple. You can do anything. If you know how to draw with a pencil and you can draw butterflies, some little girl or boy wants to learn how to draw a butterfly. You can do anything to help motivate and empower somebody. What kind of people are we looking for? People who have a heart to do the right thing. You don't need to wear the colors. That's what we say on our Facebook page. You don't need to wear a cape to be a superhero. Anybody who wants to do the right thing can be a guardian angel. Guardian angels is a philosophy. It's a lifestyle more than, more than it is a uniform. You know what I mean? So simply, simply by, by walking somebody across the street or saying hello or opening the door, that's all you need to change somebody's day. It doesn't take much. So who can be a guardian angel? Everybody is a guardian angel. Just start doing the right thing. How does, how does one get in contact with you? Oh, with me. Or well, into garden angels. How's one find out? Where do I go to become a garden angel? Well, you know, after your council meetings, you guys know when you flip on the bat signal. <laughs> <laughs> we are our we our gym, our clubhouse is on 112 North May Street. I'm here every day, all day. A lot of times the door is closed. It's because I'm training in the gym or training somebody. Bang on the door, I will hear you. The phone number is on the window, so don't give me the excuses if you can't find me. Facebook is there. Twitter is there. My phone number is there. Everything is there. You can find me. We're on the street. You can't miss this. Plus, this handsome face. There's not a lot of guys like that in Thunder Bay. So, just come up and say hello. If you really want to be in the Guardian Angels and you want the beret and the t-shirt, you got to earn that. It's like your black belt in karate or kung fu or taekwondo. Not Krav Maga because that's almost impossible. Only the select few get that. Another story for another time. But if you want to be a guardian angel and you want the uniform, all you got to do is dedicate some time and do the right thing and help us help out. Now, 
it's kind of interesting, you know, we talk about, uh, you know, can you make a difference? Here's one person making a difference in our city. Here's one person making a difference in our city in different ways. And so if you're out there, get down to the Garden Angels Clubhouse, check it out, see what's going on. If you can contribute in any small way, please do. Gentlemen, thank you very much. Always a pleasure. Thank you. Ian, always a pleasure, that's for sure. Well, take care and have a good day. It's going to be live.